Welcome to Toonheads. Tonight, we look at the career of director Norman McCabe. McCabe started at Warner Brothers in 1932 as an in-betweener. And by the late 30s, he was one of the top animators in Bob Clampett's crew. When Bob became ill for a short time, Norman was asked to complete two cartoons that Clampett had started. The cartoons were The Timid Toreador and Porky Snooze Reel. And now, we bring you lowlights in the world of sports. The following year, Tex Avery left Warner Brothers and Clampett took over Avery's crew. Norman was promoted to director and placed in charge of Clampett's old crew. One of his first cartoons as director was Who's Who in the Zoo. Norman credits his friend Chuck Jones with providing invaluable assistance on this early directorial effort. Even though Chuck was working on his own material down the hall, he stayed late and helped McCabe with most of the animation layouts in this cartoon. I can't do it. It's impossible. And now, Norman McCabe's Who's Who in the Zoo. interesting and instructive day may be spent at any one of the many fine zoos of our country. Here are assembled strange specimens from the jungles of deepest Africa. Rare creatures native to the highest Himalayas. Fleet-footed beasts of the plains and Pampas, as well as denizens of the mighty deep. At great expense and often at the peril of life and limb, they have been brought here so that you and I might know and understand our furred and feathered friends. The wolf family is represented by the timber wolf, his cousin the gray wolf, and the black sheep of the wolf family, the Hollywood wolf. You want to be in pictures, you Say, here's an old friend of ours, Porky Pig, the keeper of the zoo. Hey, Porky, where are you going with that mallet? Oh, I'm uh, going to feed the g g g g giraffe. Look at this cute little bunny. This type of rabbit is known as the cottontail. And where there are rabbits, there are hares. Here we see the famous March hares. This majestic specimen of bird life is a bald eagle. <clears throat> I reiterate. A bald eagle. A bald eagle. Okay, blabbermouth. So I am bald. Before us now is the mighty monarch of the jungle, the lion. Well, his majesty acts a little restless. He seems to be looking for something. Oh, well. One of the most vicious animals is the black panther. This one is just finishing a hearty meal. <laughs> ah, the elephant, the African elephant. And from far off India, the Indian elephant. Oh! The most hated of all birds is the vulture. A sneaky bird of prey. An unspeakable ghoul. A loathsome scavenger. 
A snake in the grass with wings. A despicable excuse for a bird. Ah. Sticks and stones can break my bones, but words can never hurt me. Yeah. The seals are getting terribly fussy lately. In fact, they're so fussy that they'll eat only fresh mountain trout. Yeah, they, they don't know from nothing. <laughs> I'll toss them a bit of a barracuda mackerel. They'll never know the difference. Well, our friend the lion again. He still seems to be looking for something. Oh, well, we hope he sees it. The Alaskan bear is one of the strongest of all animals. He uses his tremendous strength to hug his prey to death. Once he gets those strong... Hey, hey, what's he up to? No, no, not that poor little sheep. Hey, stop it. Hey, cut that out. Put that sheep down. Hey, stop it, stop it! Stop that hugging! Oh, for goodness sakes, mind your own business. Residing temporarily at the zoo are three of the famous Capistrano swallows. Tell me, little visitors, why do you always go back to Capistrano? I don't know. I guess we're just in a rut. I can't do it. I can't do it. It's impossible. My gosh, there's a limit. Well, this daddy rabbit seems very disturbed about something. Hey, what seems to be the matter? The hippopotamus. This big brute is armored like a tank. His skin is so tough that even a bullet can hardly pierce it. That's right. In fact, over all his body, there's only one a, 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 a teeny weeny a, a, a vulnerable spot. <laughs> oh, that's it. Oh, oh, that's the spot. Oh, you got it. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> well, well, here's that lion again. Still looking. He sees something. What is it that makes him so happy? Uh-oh, the ice cream man. That old lion has a sweet tooth. Huh?